In this video, I will show you how you can use your TI graphing calculator to easily convert between degrees and radians. Let's get started with our first example. Let's say you want to convert 135 degrees into radians. Well, because you want your answer in radians, you have to make sure that your calculator is set in radian mode. So I'll press mode and I'll just double check here. Oh, I'm noticing here that I'm already in radian mode, which makes sense because the default mode on your calculator is radian mode. Okay. So I will quit out of there by pressing second mode. Then I will enter 135. And then I will tell the calculator that, hey, this is 135 degrees. So I will access the angle menu by pressing second angle. And then I will select option one, which is the degree symbol. So what I have here is 135 degrees entered, but I'm in radian mode. So when I press enter, it will give me the equivalent in radians to 135 degrees. So in this case, it's rounded to 2.36 radians. Now, as an aside, you may be able to convert this answer into an exact value. It doesn't always work, but sometimes it does, and it doesn't hurt to check. So if I divide by pi, I end up with uh, 0.75, which you can convert into a rational number. Well, it is a rational number, but you can convert to a fraction by pressing math and then option number one. Okay, so that gives us three quarters. And because I divided out a pi, that means 2.36 radians is three pi over four radians. Okay. All right, let's try uh, another example. And let's go the other way this time. Let's uh, convert 11 pi over three radians into degrees. Now, because you want your answer in degrees, you have to make sure that your calculator is in degree mode. So I'll clear this. I'll press mode. And this time I'm going to select degrees. Okay, now I will quit out of there. And remember, I'm now in degree mode. So now what I need to do is enter 11 pi over three, but I'll do so in parentheses. So 11 pi over three, and then I'll close off the parentheses. So my calculator knows that this is a value that's in radians, but I also have to tell the calculator it's in radians. So again, I'll access the angle menu by pressing second apps. And this time I will access option number three, which is a little r, which stands for radians. I'll hit enter. Now I've got 11 pi over three radians in degree mode. If I press enter, it will convert 11 pi over three into 660 degrees. And that is how you use your TI graphing calculator to convert between radians and degrees.